Let's learn how to rotate guides in Illustrator in this quick and simple tutorial. With your blank document created, start by going to View, Rulers, Show Rulers. For the purposes of this exercise, I'm going to drag out three guides at 500 pixels each on the canvas because I have a canvas width of 2000. Next, go to View, Guides and Unlock Guides. Use the selection tool to select one of the guides. Then come over to the left hand bar and select your rotate tool. Once the rotate tool is selected, you will see here that it will automatically add a point of rotation in the center of the line. I'm happy to rotate from this center, but if you want to put that point of rotation anywhere else, you can simply click on the guide. Once you're happy with your point of rotation, simply click and drag and you can adjust and rotate the guide to any degree that you like. Command and Control Z to come back. So that's how you freehand a singular guide with a rotate tool. If you'd like to move multiple guides in unison, come to your selection tool, click and drag over all the guides you would like to rotate so that they're then all selected. Come back to the rotation tool and press it. As before, you can see the rotation tool has created a point of rotation in the center of the guides. I'm happy with this. So hover over this point of rotation, hold the Alt key and then click to bring up your rotate panel. Drag this over to the side, make sure your preview's on, and then put in the angle at which you would like the guides to rotate. So I'm gonna try 20 degrees. Press preview, and you can see now it will show you what the guides will look like once rotated. Once you're happy with this rotation angle, simply press okay. And then finally, to keep these guides locked in place then so you don't adjust them, go to view, guides, and lock guides. And there you have it. That's how you rotate guides in Illustrator. I really hope you found this tutorial helpful, and if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, keep on designing, and I'll see you for the next tutorial.